This is code.org. I'm currently working on their AP Computer Science Principles course. Let's see what we're doing. Moving memory. Try another one. Here's the starting code. X is equal to 2, Y3, Z, 0. And oh yeah, we want X, the value of X, to be 3. So, and right now it starts at 2, and the value of Y should be 2, and it starts at 3. Ooh, I don't want a hint. That seems like uh, something we'll do if we get stuck. Okay. So you want it to print in the console log. And like we said, right now, X is going to print out 2. Y is equal to 3 because right X, 2, Y, 3. You may only add lines that of code that reassign variables. That means like X equals Y, something like that you can do. You may only use equals and arithmetic operators like plus, minus, times, and divide. You may not type or introduce any numbers. So I can't do like, oh, look y now equals 50 or 5 that's not allowed okay and you may not change or alter console log yeah i can't do oh look x equals 3 that's not what we're doing all right so let's make this happen i need x to be 3 y to be 2 and they gave us this extra variable hmm well that kind of makes me curious because we haven't had that before and i'm noticing look these are already the values we need them. We just need to flip flop them. So let's say I do Z is now equal to X. Okay. And then what could I do? Well, if Z is now equal to X, what would Z be? Z would now be two. Okay. And what do I need X to be? Three. Well, then I can go ahead and change X. X is going to be equal to Y, right? But I still have this two value available. See, before, we, if we changed y, we would lose the 3 that x needs to be. If we changed x, we'd lose the 2 that y needs to be. Here, it's like a temporary storage bin. I said, hey, I know this 2 needs to go into y, but let's give it to z right now. z is equal to 2, and then let's make y's value, uh, let's make x's value equal to 3, equal to y. And now, let's go ahead and change y to that two to two to two, and we stored that two in our z value. So we change y to z. Let's see what happens. Quapow. Ooh, that one's tricky. It's nice that we have this extra variable. Kind of uh, made me think when they gave it to us. Oh, yep, and that's what the hint's about. Awesome. Let's keep going. 